what's up everyone? Welcome back to the continuation of my out of print and discontinued movies. I'm going to be continuing on to the Blu-ray shelf, but first let me start off right here on my box set. So the first one I got up is, and by the way, if you're new to watching this series, definitely go back and check out the ones I did of my DVD collection and steel books. So there's a lot more on those videos and I talk about how I found out on how these are discontinued. So the first one up is the Christopher Nolan Director's uh, Collection. That one was discontinued. And then the next one up, I didn't find it on that one website, but I'm having troubles here. Here we go. It wasn't on that webpage, but I thought I saw people on eBay trying to sell the Creepshow, Air, well, Creepshow 2 Arrow Edition. I saw a couple people saying this is out of print on eBay, but didn't find it on the website. Next one up. I don't think any of those were so this one was the Wolverine let me put that one down the Wolverine 3d blu-ray set things are falling out sorry I'm trying to zoom through these so I can get to these really quick but this is one unique box set I really like this one this one's discontinued as I said it's the 3d blu-ray digital code it came with a couple postcards in it too it's pretty cool I love this collection and the next one up I'm pretty sure this one said it was but I couldn't remember because I looked it up yesterday and then I forgot to pull all these out the ones that were discontinued but sorry if I'm wrong on this one the X-Men Days of Future Past 3D Blu-ray it's the one that came in like the Best Buy limited edition box I love this collection so that was it on this top row of Blu-rays right here besides I'm not going to count that the Willy Wonka because it's a limited edition that's kind of obvious. So with that said, now we're going to be jumping on to the Blu-ray shelf. So the first one up is a really wild film. Wow, this film is just really messed up and in a good way to where you get a good enjoyment out of it. Beyond the Darkness, really crazy movie. That one's discontinued. And I mentioned this in the other videos that the movies are not discontinued, but the slip covers are actually hard to find on some of the older Shop Factory releases. So if you have some slip covers from Shop Factories, maintain them, keep them in good condition because they're really hard to find a couple months later. Next one up is this version of The Breakfast Club. It's the 100th anniversary Blu-ray DVD and digital code. It pops open. I don't feel like unwrapping it because I got it taped down really tight because I have another copy down in the living room that's really easy to find in like the dump bins at Best Buy. And the other one I have, Bubba Didn't Do It, Dark Knight of the Scarecrow. I love this movie. I would love to get that mask someday. I think it was Trick or Treat Studios that have it, but right now <laughs> I'm done spinning with Christmas around the corner. Oh my gosh. I hate this time of the year because your wallet hates you. And also to mention, if you didn't catch the other videos, I already mentioned that I'm not going through and showing you details of what the Blu-ray looks like or the DVD looked like it's because that's not the point of the video I'm just showing you what I have in my collection of the ones that are out of print and discontinued the next one up is a double feature of Dr. Giggles and Otis Otis seems to get you know no talk and no love I love that movie I got a kick out of it I would love to see its own release I think they have it on DVD but not blu-ray I could be wrong I just don't know I haven't looked into it because I got the double pack but anyway the faculty this version's out of print okay the next one up according to that website the final destination 3d i have the slip cover and final destination 5 according to that website these are discontinued okay the next one up and the reason why a lot of disney ones this finding nemo is discontinued the reason why they love to re-release a lot of their movies if not every single one of them so you can buy one today within months later more likely it's going to be discontinued because about half a year later they'll re-release it different cover same features and everything but this finding nemo that's discontinued next one up friday the 13th end cut this one's discontinued along with the remake the killer cut <sighs> didn't care for this movie but that's just my opinion so that version's discontinued and G.I. Joe, The Rise of Cobra, this two disc digital copy edition, that one's out of print. And everybody's favorite comic book movie, Green Lantern, extended the cut, that one's out, uh, discontinued. 
Sorry I keep switching back from saying discontinued and out of print because I do have a lot of people on Instagram saying like it's called discontinued, it's called out of print. So sorry I keep changing back and forth. I think they're the same thing. I could be wrong. I just don't care. You get my point. Just here to share what I have. The hangover, the one where it came with like a hundred photos from the missing camera, that one's out, uh, discontinued. Hangover part two, this version's discontinued, but part three was not. And the next one up, the first Harry Potter, this version's uh, been discontinued. And this Hellraiser, and I already explained it, the ones that say Echo Bridge, anything from them is going to be discontinued because that company went under. But this is the one with Hellraiser Bloodline, Inferno, Hellseeker, and Hellworld. That one's discontinued. And I think this one said it was. As I said, I looked it up last week and I forgot to pull a few of these out. But the three disc of Deluxe Edition from Target. This one, discontinued. Along with the last one on the shelf. The Incredibles, the two disc Blu-ray DVD and digital copy edition. Discontinued. Next one up. Interstellar, this is the one that came with the bundle pack from Walmart. It came with like a film cell, and I forget what else it came with. I got it in the closet in there, not going to unbury it, but this Walmart edition, that one's discontinued. Along with, as I already mentioned about Disney, they keep re-releasing things, so whatever you have is going to be discontinued sometime soon. Uh, Iron Man Ultimate 2 Disc uh, Edition, Iron Man 2, the Blu-ray DVD digital code, and Iron Man 3, Blu-ray and DVD. Jack Frost, the lenticular cover. I I love this movie. I don't care what anyone says. A lot of people hate it. I love it. And Let Me In. This is the one that came with like a little mini comic book and the slip cover. The Little Mermaid, Diamond Edition. Now this next one, I was shocked to see. Mean Girls, that's been discontinued. More than likely, they're gonna re-release it into like a bundle pack maybe. I would like to see a 4K release of it, but I doubt if that's going to happen, but yeah, if you got Mean Girls, hang on to it. That's been discontinued, and prices are going up already on eBay for it. Next one up, I got lucky with this one, My Bloody Valentine. My friend Patrick picked this up for me at Target. Someone returned it, and they took it, but it wasn't on their file, apparently. I don't know. I don't work with Target or anything, but he was explaining how it ended up on their shelf. wasn't supposed to be. He picked it up. Got it for me, so I can't thank you enough, Patrick, for that one. And the next one up is this edition of, darn it, this edition of Nightmare Before Christmas. And the one that fell, Ninja Assassins, discontinued. Okay, the only one I got on the lower shelf right here, the ring, this is the one that has that lenticular cover. A lot of people are after this one and not getting rid of that one. I had one offer for it already. Not getting rid of anything. I love to collect. And continuing on, as I said earlier about slip covers from Shout Factory, Sleepaway Camp 2 and 3, those ones, be careful with your slip covers. Along with the Target editions of Spider-Man 1 and 2, I think you know why I don't have part 3 in my collection, but those slip covers, people are wanting those, those you can't find anymore. Along with Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 1, 2, and 3 triple feature I got at Walmart back then, that's been discontinued. Along with Thor and Thor The Dark World, those have been discontinued. And by the way, I have the slipcover for the first one, but not the second one. Did, they didn't release a slipcover for that one around my neck of the woods, that is. And Toy Story 2, that one's been discontinued. And the very last two that I have down here, Trick or Treat, this one's been discontinued because Shout Factory re-released a better edition, so... That's the reason why they discontinued that. And the last one is up, the Blu-ray, DVD, and digital code. So that does it for my Blu-ray discontinued slash out of print movies that I have in my collection. So as I said before, let me know what you have that, or if you got a video of it, I'll come over and check it out. What do you have in your collection that's out of print? And what is your favorite one? I can't pick a favorite one out of my collection. I have quite a few good ones. So I'm going to be wrapping it up and the next time I upload one of these videos in my box sets and Halloween editions over behind where this camera is. So stay tuned for that video. Thank you once again for stopping by and watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. I'll check you later.